Hey guys, welcome to Algebra Daily, week four, day one. Uh, so today we're going to be looking at these two questions, and as usual, hopefully they help you with the questions that you have for the day. Okay, so let's get started with the first one here. Uh, what we have is we have got an x squared multiplied with x to the power of four and plus x squared. Now, remember, according to rules of bed mass, you've actually got to do multiplication first. So I'm going to do the multiplication of these two terms first. So I've got x squared times x to the power of four which is x to the power of 2 plus 4. And as for the x squared, I'm just going to leave it as it is. In this case, I've got x to the power of 2 plus 4, which equals x to the power of 6 plus x squared. Now remember, these are not like terms. So that means you can't actually add them up together. And most likely, somebody will make this mistake of writing this as x to the power of 8. And that's actually incorrect. Okay, so this is our final answer, and we leave it out as it is. Okay, so let's look at the second question here. We've got g to the power of 7 divided by g to the power of 3 plus g to the power of 4. So we got to work out these two first. Now we know that uh, simplifying this expression means subtracting the powers. So g to the power of 7 minus 3 plus g to the power of 4. g to the power of 7 minus 3 is g to the power of 4, and g4 stays as it is. Now, when we combine these two terms, remember that this actually equals to two lots of g to the power of 4. And as usual, you will see some people making this mistake of writing this as g to the power of 8. And that is actually in, is incorrect. Cool. That's it for this short video, guys. Hopefully it helps with today's questions. Thank you for watching.